A jewel merchant named Merlinus now joins Elwood's group. With Merlinus in tow, they set out for Laos the following day. Laos is located in the hearts of Alicia, a territory ruled by the power-hungry Marquess of Laos, Lord Darren. Preparations for the war of which the Theron Magistrate spoke. The disappearance of Elwood's father, Elbert. The death of Marquess Santa Rose. To all these revolve around Lord Darren? In Elwood's heart, the need for truth is drowned in fear. A fear of what the truth may hold. Oh, this is getting good, dudes. Chapter 14, False Friends. Oh no, dude. Are you certain Farah's heir is here? Yes, father. We've just received word from our lookouts. Still beyond the hill, but he'll be here before long. Lord Ephidel, what is the meaning of this? Oh no! Perhaps when they reached Santorus Castle, Lord Hellman was still cleaning a life. You can't be serious. Couldn't have lasted too long, but maybe he told them something. That's terrible. Our plan, it's all for naught, isn't it? No need to be so alarmed, my lord. Even if he told young Elwood something of our schemes, Farad no longer has any power. All Elwood could do is perhaps inform Marquess Ostia. Ostia, that would be ruinous. Lord Uther may be young and new to the throne, but he's dangerous. That adopated Hellman, he was a coward to the end. To betray us now, when we're so close. We only need a little more time to complete our plans for rebellion. Then before Marquess Ostia becomes aware of any of this, you would do well to stop them right here. Yes, you're right, of course. We do have a chance. They have to pass through Laos to get to Ostia. We can still silence them. They must not pass, no matter the cost. Let us make haste, call up our finest troops. Father, please, let me take command. Eric, tell me, son, can you succeed? That Claude Elwood and I studied together in Ostia. He's a trusting fool. If he sees me, he'll lower his guard. And when he does, we strike. I see. You snakes! I beg your pardon, is this not too much for him? If by strange chance he fell, things could turn for the worst. No. I know I'm the lad's father, but Eric's quite clever, I tell you. Snuffing Pharaoh's whelp will be no trouble at all. It's settled. It's up to you now, Eric. Bring me the head of Pharaoh's darling son. Yes, father. I will not fail. This is some great Game of Thrones shit, what the fuck? Look around. They truly are preparing for battle. But, Marquess Laos, what is he scheming? Dodge. You don't much look like you want to go to the castle. If we go and learn the truth, we may have to go to war. That's fine with me. I, I have no love for war. If I concentrate on the foe before me, I'm fine. If I picture the families, innocents caught up in our foolish politics, if I imagine them, all I can do is pray for a way to resolve things peacefully. Elwood. Dude, Elwood is so cool, dude. Lord Elwood. A knight has ridden forth from the castle. A lone knight. Yes, my lord. Our scouts say it's Marquess Laus' son, Eric. He's asking to see you. Eric? Gah. Why did it have to be that buffoon? I will see him. Bring him here. I'm leaving. I never could abide him. I'll go for a ride and survey our surroundings. Don't trust him, Elwood! Hello, it's been a long time, Elwood. Eric, what is your business? My business? What do you mean? I heard my old friend was here in Laos. I merely thought I'd ride out and greet you. Hmm. So tell me, friend, what brings you to Laos? Are you on your way to Ostia? Hmm, why would you think that? Well, you were always such good friends with Hector. He and I never got along very well. For Noble, his behavior was crude, and his matter of speech. 
You'd have thought him a peasant at first glance. Still friends with Hector, aren't you? When did you last see him? How did you communicate? Eric, you're after something. What is it? Pardon? Everywhere I look, Laos prepares for battle. What are you and your father planning? I will know the truth. Hmm, I'd hope to wait until you told me of Ostia. Of whether you've spoken with the Marquess or not. What are you talking about? <laughs> Elwood, I have always despised you. How I've longed to smash you and your pathetic morality into pieces. I dreamt of this day, and here it is at last. Too bad you'll not live to see the end of it. Hector. You, Hector. You couldn't. Have you spoken to Ostia already? Maybe we have, maybe we haven't. Elwood, this mongrel has troops lined in ambush all around us. Laos regulars, everyone. We're in for a rough time. <laughs> There's little point in fighting. You're trapped. My forces will overwhelm you. An unending torrent of soldiers. Laos's elite knights are at the ready as well. <laughs> How long do you think you can survive? Craven Cur. Dude, this is getting real, dudes. Shit! They got us surrounded. Who's this? <laughs> A world of trouble you've landed yourself in, yes? Who? You startled me, old woman. You should get out of here. This is gonna be a bad place to stay if you plan on living. I want to see the one searching for his father, Marquess Ferris' son. Listen up, old woman. You're close to death as it is. Quit your yammering and move on. Hector, you should mind your manners. I am Elwood. May I ask your name, lady? Ho ho ho. What a polite young man. I'm Hannah, a fortune teller. I came here to help you. You can tell me where my father's gone. No, but I can see other things. Useful things. I can tell you what weapons to take into battle. As well as who should wield them. Things of that nature. I see. Don't tell me you believe any of this. I have no reason to believe or disbelieve in Hannah's powers. But I'll not rule out anything if it helps me find my father. Lord Elwood. Lord Hector. I make my living as a humble merchant. If you have any items you no longer need, please let poor Merlinus take them. Hehehehe. <laughs> I'm here too. Speak to me for auguries before you engage the enemy. My services are not free, but they may save you from paying a greater price. Alright, so now we can use the fortune teller. Valuable battle information can be viewed here as well as tactitional data. I see. Okay, very interesting. Alright, so looks like we're bringing the full squad. Squad out, dudes. Let's see. Let's go ahead and give you your extra heals that we got. We also got extra vulneraries. Who could benefit from that? You know what? Let's go ahead and trade the mine. There's some very interesting things we can do with this, I've heard. Which I will be showing off. Not on this chapter, or maybe not even any of the coming ones. We'll see. We'll figure it out. Okay. Hmm. Right here. Alright, let's go ahead and trade stuff with... Uh, you got a secret book. Let's go ahead and give that to Hector, right? Torches. I mean, I could give one to you. I heard that you could benefit from these far more than other peeps, so sure. Still sword, still lance. And we bought an extra javelin, that's right. Your javelin's durability is a little low. I mean... Here, let's see. Dust. I lost Marcus, there he is. 20. You know what? Let's go ahead and give you this. I feel like I'm going to be using you a bit more. Even though you'll lose your range, you'll be fine with these two. You're Marcus. That's right. I need to watch that durability for you too, buddy. Okay. Hmm. That looks to be good for now. God, I'm so glad they gave us the results screen. <laughs> Finally. Or not the, the preparation screen, I should say. Really had to afford out some stuff. I think we're gonna chill on the fortune teller thing for now. Cause it costs money. And I don't think, I think we got this. Let's go ahead and check our formation. Javelin users. 
Javelin and Iron Lance, right. So, these guys are a problem. Let's go ahead and get our uh, fighters at the ready. Hmm, how are we gonna do this, dude? So, I see we got like two villages, like here and here. Would they attack their own village? I don't know why they would do that, but I mean, we want to visit them, right? So, I'm thinking what we could do. Oh, yeah, we can't move Elwood, that's right. Well, Marcus beast mode his way, like down here, because he does not care. And then we can uh, deal with every. God, there's so many of them, dude. This is gonna be a gnarly battle, bros. Right? Mm hmm, honest win. You go like right here. Hmm, maybe you could take up the rear. Or alternatively, you could go this way. That's right. Uh huh. Alright. This is gonna be sick, dude. Let's go ahead and start this up and see what we do. Lord Elwood, shall I join you? If you deploy my tent, I can help with equipment. I can switch items for you and hold them if your packs are full. However, my tent cannot be moved about, so if you deploy it, it will require a guard. I beg your understanding. Merlinus Merchant Tent can be deployed on this map. If you deploy the tent, any items you cannot carry can be sent to the tent. However, the tent is vulnerable to enemy attack. If the tent loses all of its HP, it will vanish from the map and remain unavailable until the next map. Merlinus's tent gains one level for every battle it survives. The tent will be harder to destroy as it increases in level. Deploy Merlinus? Uh, it sounds no drawback. I mean, we could try it. Apparently, we just do it again on the next map if it is destroyed. So, sure, why not? Even though this does seem like a gnarly battle. <laughs> Picks, let me take points. There may be many of them, but numbers are meaningless. We are knights of Farah. These mice of Laos will never defeat us. Hmm. Oh, there's my guy. Nice. Hmm. We certainly could stand some assistance. I'm sorry, but it's just not possible. If we disobey Marcus Laos, who knows what might happen to us. I understand. We'll seek our aid elsewhere. You'll find the same answer everywhere you go. Eventually, you'll have to do as the Marquess orders. You would do well to tell your employer the same theme. Hmm. Good day to you. I said good day. There's my boy. I was wondering when he was going to show up. So we got to get... <laughs> I think I know just the person. <laughs> oh, look how perfect this turned out. All right. Um, all right. Well, first of all, we got, we got some goons over here. Let's go ahead and give this man the hands. No, oh, God. Don't hurt his horse. Bart. God, I just feel bad now. Let's go ahead and attack this man. Show him how it's done, Dorcas. There you go. Ow, though. That definitely went through my chest. Okay. So I know they have the advantage, but... Um... God, durability is so low for that. I actually don't think I should attack with you at all. I'll do four. If we hit both of them, dude. But if we don't... Uh, we could try it. Alright. There you go, buddy. There's a ch high chance for him to miss, too. Matthew is an expert at dodging. There you go, buddy. Nice. Well done. Even get a level up off it. Well deserved. Level 6. I want him to be super sick, dude. Matthew is awesome. Okay, he's gonna have the advantage on us, too. But I think we'll be able to take him out. Hit 75. Let's try it. Nice. There you go, guy. Cool. Fortunately, his durability for the Killing Edge is very mighty low right now. Hmm. Alright. So that's our number one priority, is getting my boy to safety. How are we gonna do that, dude? Hmm. Spear user is mighty annoying right here. It's also a matter of this. Hmm. i check this. Sure. The pirates from that citadel in the south keep raiding a nearby village. 
The Marquess ignores it, our pleas for help. We'll all be overrun someday. Someone should go to that village and warn them. Oh, okay, I think I know where this is going. So, the pirates are gonna show up and attack the village? Oh, Alright, you're gonna have to bum rush, dude. You can go in on these fools, can't you? What, what are we working with? They all have lances. All of them. And you don't care about the archer. Hmm. Attack with your lance. Alright, let's do it. Try to take one of these goons out. Hopefully they'll focus on Marcus. There we go, buddy. There's just so many of them. Yeah, I think we want to get down to that village as soon as possible. I think Marcus is the way to do that. Um, we can get you out here too. Because you'll have the advantage over them. Uh-huh. Let's see. I need to get you over there safely somehow. Hmm. Attack. Javelin. Twice. Oh, uh, okay, we can do this. Just like so. Nice, alright. <laughs> I love the animation for the javelin. It's so fast. It just amuses me. Alright, level 5, buddy. There you go. Nice. Get a little more defense. Cool. Get that one resistance. Much faster than Dorcas. Mmm, I see. Okay, let's get you up here safely. Move you in two. And Rebecca, you come up at the rear. Alright, let's see. Hmm. Oh shit, dude, they're going for Urk. Oh no. Alright, well we have the advantage, like I said. So we should be fine. Yeah, Hector is gonna annihilate these dudes. Beautiful. Alright. So hopefully they go for him. Uh, they opt to go for Lowen. Huh, a little chip, not too bad, not too bad, alright. Hmm. Javelin is not doing too much, unfortunately. <laughs> this is just funny. Oh my god, you actually did one point of damage. Look at you. Hmm. Oh, Urk to the rescue. There's my boy. Oh shit. <laughs> they call me Zeus. Alright. <laughs> oh, it's funny. Priscilla, has your escort returned yet? No. Oh, dude, that's Urk. Okay. No. He left yesterday in search of a way out of here. I just hope the soldiers of Laos haven't captured him. His search for help must have been fruitless. Marcus Laos has ordered that no one, a no aid be given to you. There's really nothing that any of us can do. I apologize, but no, no. You can turn me over to the Marquess. And yet, you continue to grant me asylum. I'm grateful for that. Of course, if I simply went to the castle, this would all be over. Don't fret over that. None of us are overly fond of the Marquess. He's always threatening us. He treats us like slaves. All of these war preparations, we want nothing to do with them. We may be divided into territories, but we're Lysians, one and all. We may be invaded by another country one day. But why does he want to start a war here at home? None of us understand what he is doing. Wow, it sounds like um, none of the people of Laos are really too fond of their uh, Marquesses. Check this house. Listen to this. Have you heard tell of the Marquesses infatuation? There's a young woman staying in a village on the harbor. Her speech, her looks, everything about her has the seeming of a princess. The Marquesa's attention border on obsession. He sent countless envoys to invite her to the castle, but she rejects him at every turn. Now, the Marquesa has guards around the village, keeping her trapped. She has no way to escape, it's so sad. Oh, okay. So that's Priscilla? I see. So he, he, wants, he wants to get with Priscilla, and she hired Urk to like, get away out oh and this is like the guard that's keeping her in the village that's gnarly dude that's like a little mini story in this that's crazy i love that all right so we need to get over there asap if 
that is indeed the case, let's go ahead and head on down, dudes. And I kind of need you guys to go in on these guys. Yeah, there you go. Give him the Wolfane Fist. Bam. Mm-hmm. Oh, I didn't like th that, did you? There you go, buddy. Show these goons what's what, Hector. Yeah, they're all they're all spear users. Let's go ahead and go in with our dudes then. Telio and whatnot. Move you up here. You're, you're a little vulnerable because we have the sword. You too, Matthew. Yeah, can we talk? Nope. Oh yeah, no, that's right. <laughs> yeah, look, it works. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's Eric. It's been so long. What are you doing here? Oh, Sarah. You're the last person I wanted to see. Oh, that's so sweet. You wanted to see me again. <sighs> hey, I know. This is perfect. Come with us and lend a hand, Eric. I beg your pardon. Come on. I'll even introduce you to Lords Hector and Elwood. I know you. You're probably just wandering around without work. No, Sarah. I'm afraid I'm gainfully employed. However, if you're fine Laos, this might work out after all. What are you babbling about? Make up your mind, will ya? My employer is hiding in a village south of here. Fucking knew it, dude. If you'll help me protect her, I'll join up with you. Alright, of course I'll- Nice, dude. There's my boy. Oh, what, what is this? Increases luck by two. Vanishes after you. No kidding. I see. Alright. Well. Uh, sure. Want more luck? You, you you know what? You're my boy. You get this. Alright, let's go ahead. Oh, I see. We got this guy right here. Let's move in with this guy, dude. Back at the rear. Yeah, no one can reach us here. We'll be fine. Oops. Meep meep. Alright, let's see how this turns out. Who's going for Hector? Bad call. IMO. Yeah. Oh, he even gets the fancy an animation for that one. Nicely done, my boy. Okay. Alright, let's see how this pans out. A little chips, it's fine. A little DiMaggio, as it were. Okay. Uh, it's just so many dudes. Dude, Hector is gonna go off. <laughs> Look, they're even missing him and everything. Wow. Hector is badass, dude. Look at him go. Nice. Okay. Hmm. Now we gotta be careful. We don't want these guys getting packed past Hector. Dude, he's just critting everyone. Wow. Mm, the archer is gonna bully around my Dorcas. Shit. That's just mean. Why would anyone want to bully Dorcas? <gasps> uh, what's this? What's all this then? Looks like a war is broken out. <laughs> Perfect. Time for a raid. Up and out of mates. That village is ripe for plunder. The fuck are you? It's a pirate! You are hard, hard lady. No way. Oh, yeah, that's right. There's pirates in Path of Radiant. That's right. Okay. Huh. Alright. So, if that's indeed the case, let's go ahead and head down here. Take out this buffoon. Have some of these. You met. Oh, you got. Me. No, my horse, though. Oh, that's fine, dude. He just, he just skimmed his armor. He couldn't penetrate it. Horsey chicks will be fine. Alright. Huh. As for you, buddy. Have some of this. Huh? Uh, oh. Well, you missed. Shit. I, I'm just embarrassed for both of you. Okay. That's fine. Dorcas. Bum rush him, dude. Give him the work. Ow. <laughs> How he's still alive? I do not know. Hmm. Okay. Finish him off, buddy. 
Ah, shit. On Fort, dude. I feel like his moves are very inaccurate, unfortunately. Alright. Uh, we can't even... Alright, it's fine. We wait up there. If we go in with Urk, we will be able to get him. Yeah. <laughs> He's dead. <laughs> He's as good as dead. That's my boy Urk, right? I'm so happy we got him back, dude. <laughs> Where's your fire spell, Urk? I got you an extra one, didn't I? Oh, nice, dude. There you go. Yeah, it's fine. Dude, there's like hardly any of them left now. Alright, cool. So, let's go ahead and get a little more chip with our javelin, as I like to say. It's called a javelin. I don't want anyone to get confused. It's actually, it's called a javelin. I like to say javelin, though. It's not a real word, but it's fun to say. Okay, let's go ahead and sh shoot the bad guy. We met. We met down on the kill, I should say. On forts. Alright, so what I want you to do is get to safety. And that will do it for now. Let's see. Oh, that boy is running. There's no escape, Dorcas. Alright. Let's just make that clear. Alright, Loan. Looks like you're going to be able to finish up right over here. Beautiful. Well done. Now let's see. Okay, who's next? Oh, the pirate's coming in, dudes. Mmm, my bones ache. The signs point to rain, yes? Oh no, watch yourselves. Oh fuck, dude. So it's gonna rain now, dudes, alright? Um. So. Uh, let's go ahead. I see you're coming from the mountains. Hmm. Rebecca, let's visit this town. You're battling Eric and his men, right? Let me tell you, I'm on your side. My granddaughter, Marquez Laos, took her away. He found her pretty and forced her to the castle. That's awful. It's not much, but please take this. It's a large sword, so you have to be strong to use it. It's a bit unwieldy, but it is a mighty weapon nonetheless. I hope you can defeat the Marquez's son, Eric. It would make our life so much more pleasant. Good luck to you. Wow, that's very, very sad, dudes. I don't like these guys. Wait, you got a sword? Can we trade? An iron blade, dude. Look at this. You know what? That's perfect. My rapier is actually uh, starting to get pretty low on that good old durability. So, thank you. That works. Okay, so you're a little, you're a little roughed up, Loan. Let's let's fix that. Nice little heal. There we go. Good as new, dude. Oh, look. And Sarah got a level up, dude. Nice. Beautiful. Okay. Um, I suppose we could vis visit this now. Um, Is it true we're battling Castle Ostia? What could that fool of a Marquess be thinking? Laos has no chance in defeating Lysia's most powerful territory. The Marquess's son, Eric, is nothing but a power-hungry dullard. And the Marquess himself is a ledger. Plain and simple. What a pair. Do they believe they're a match for an Austian general? Oh. Forget everything I said. We never talked, okay? <laughs> well, that just meant that um, everyone in <laughs> all the villagers of Laos uh, just despise this place. Oh, we're at a timer? Oh, defeat enemies. Left 11. I thought that was turns, right? Alright, so about this whole archer scenario. Okay. Dorcas smash! Nice, dude. There you go, Dorcas. Nicely done, my boy. <laughs> Gonna get that one res? No? Still no. That's fine. Alright, so we got pirates, dudes. Go ahead and check this. Visits. Again, are you another messenger from the Marquess? Please do not waste your time. I will not change my decision. Pardon, Marquess Laos did not send you. I, I beg your forgiveness. It was my mistake. Say, if it's not too much trouble, might I leave with you? I'm on a journey. Marquess Laos is burying my way and I'm trapped. I'm trained in the use of staffs. Please help me. Oh, sure. 
Oh, okay. I didn't know you were a unit. Mend? Restores many HP. Dude, she's like a mounted healer. Oh, that's sick. Okay, so you can only use staffs. I see. Oh, dope fish. All right. Oh, uh, sweet. What's your range, boys? Right. Okay, so. I mean, I could. He. It's just a little chip. Let's go ahead and see what we got here. Got some iron armor, I see. Okay. If you don't buy anything, you could uh, cancel out. It's pretty cool. There's the fire spells. We need these. Yeah, Urk. Absolutely needs these. Let's see. Do I get a third? No, I think we'll be fine with two. Four now. I'm sure there'll be m many more fire spells. Dude, she's sick. She looks really cool, too. All right, nice. Um, Your health is a little low, Hector. Let's go in with you. Oh, that's right. We still have the secret book. Sure. You know what? You can have it. You're a lord, so I want to keep you safe. Going with you a bit, buddy. Alright, Matthew. Time to go in. Although, it doesn't seem like there's much we can do to those guys. Let's start bringing our sword users down. Okay, let's see what we can do. Blast the stronger than I had supposed. To the castle. I want all the reinforcements available, and I want them now. Oh no, dude. Lord Eric is struggling. He requests reinforcements. What? Ready the men. Unbelievable. These numbers cannot stop them. Ephidel, where are you going? It seems that conquering Lycia might have been too much to ask of you after all. I must inform my master. The Black Fane will be leaving at once. No! You! You can't abandon us! Not at this stage. Who was it that said Ostia mustn't learn of our plans? Was not you, Lord Darren, the Marquess of Laos himself? Y yes, it was. There's no turning back for me now. Not now. Please, one more. Give me one more chance. I assure you, I will not disappoint Lord Nurgle. Very well. Assemble your men. We will regroup elsewhere. Huh? You can't mean... My son. My home. Am I to abandon them? Would you fall in disgrace Lalan with your son? Our master, Lord Nerg Nurgle, is offering you the throne of all of Lycia. Surely a few sacrifices are not too much to ask. Yes, you're Wow, dude, he would throw his own son to the dogs for the throne? What a guy. My destiny is greater than this. I am bored to be king of Lycia. Now for an heir, you're still young, my lord. You will have time. You must not let a moment's sentimentality cloud your judgment. Dots. Wow. Where are my reinforcements? They haven't come. I have no choice. I must attack. You, to the castle. Find more men. Yes, my lord. Oh, wow. All right, Dorcas. Show them what's what. Ow. There you go, buddy. Oh, you missed. That's what I like to see. Shit, dude. Oh, fuck. Damage. <laughs> Dane. The guy didn't stand a chance. Oh, it's starting to rain, dudes. I see. Hmm. The sword user. Axe wielders come from above. We've got a Rebecca here. I think our best course of action right here, we've already checked this, is to retreat our dudes up here because it's a little dangerous. There's a bunch of spear users over there. Yeah, that's right. We'll, re we'll regroup, dudes. All right? That's for you, buddy. Bart, you're a little injured, but... He can attack twice with you. 9-9. Nine, nine. That's way too dangerous. Dorcas, what about you, buddy? He can attack you twice. We'll go for it. Come on, buddy. Take him out. Nice. There we go. Sweet. 
since you're so hurt, let's get you back here. And unfortunately, he doesn't have a vulnerary. But well, that's fine. We got our sword user just in case he wants to try to attack us. Move you up. Move you. Let's check this. I want to see how this works. So I could buy one of these. Iron lance, iron sword. We definitely need more swords. Sensu. Yes! Nice! Because we definitely needed another sword. Okay, beautiful. Hmm, your health is a little low, so what we'll do is use a Vulnerary. Right. So you're right here and wait. Matthew, you start making your way downtown. Right? And that should be good for now. Let's see. Let's see if they want to move on out in the rain. They're going straight from Dorcas. Eh. Nice, dude. Freaking payar har har late. Lady. <laughs> Alright, our turn. Can you make it all the way over there, dude? Almost. And forts. Alright, guy. It looks like this one's all you. Let's take him out. Dude, you got the badass technique and everything. He hits him with the flips and shit. Alright, Dorcas, you're a little injured, so be careful. Let's have you right here. Uh huh. Up. And we'll go ahead and move you here. Let's... I mean, it might be a little overkill. It's fine. I want to see this, uh... New... Oh, whoa, dude. Apparently, it's very, very good. <laughs> I'm assuming because the circle is so large. Alright. How cool. Alright. I'll send you up here. i send you this way. Alright. Let's see. Now, the rain is slowing them down as well. Mm hmm. This rain will end shortly. Dude, more pirates are showing up. Shit. I want to move back a little bit with you, buddy. Move you out a little bit. Mm hmm. Yeah, I'm trying to regroup all my dudes here. Mm hmm. You guys are still fine. The pirates are still pretty far away. So let's move together. It's going to change soon. Go ahead and use one of your vulnerary Storkis. Guy, there's not much you can do for us here. You're so hurt, though. Let's move you towards Sarah. Yeah, Matthew, I think you and Guy should retreat for now. Huh, yeah, that's fine. Alright. Rain should probably end. After their, this turn right here. Mmm, those guys are kind of an issue. We'll try to keep them down, I suppose. Right. Alright, rain's over. You desperately need to heal, my boy. Oops. Yeah, no, it's fine. Oops. Heal him up. So he can get down there and deal with those guys. Nice, dude. Well done. Alright. Hmm. Marcus? What do we want from you, buddy? We'll go right here. Oh, that's right. Okay, so... Send you down this way. Send you right here. Beautiful. Now Dorcas will be full HP as well. Beautiful, dude. Sweet. Well done, Priscilla. Alright, let's go ahead and guard this. Are you in the ocean? You're in sand, I see. That gives you five avoidance. Cool. Now I want you to be back here. No, you don't have to go all the way back, All right? I'm just... I don't want to lose Urk. It's down ahead of these guys. Ooh, these guys are closing in too. I don't... Nope. Item. Quits. Maybe we bait him out. Alright, Rebecca. Back him up. Alright, let's see. Hmm. Here come the pirates. They're swimming on over, dudes. Exactly what I wanted to see right here. Nice. Hit him hard, Lowen. 
Sweet. Okay. Alright, this guy is as good as dead. Go, Ram. The Hector is getting all the experience today, dude. <laughs> He's soaking it in. Nice, he kind of needed a little boost too. Whoa, what a level up. Sweet. All across the board. Beautiful, dude. Yeah. This is working out swimmingly. Look, he's not even doing any damage to us at all now. At this point, Hector's way too badass. Nice. So I'd like to see. Alright, Loan. How much will this do? 10? Okay, perfect. Alright, we'll take him out. Give him a good old whacking. Little counterattack here. Oh yeah, he has a low chance to even hit. Awesome. We'll be able to sweep over Rebecca. This is fun, man. There's so many dudes here. Alright, and you're all set now, so we can send you in. Dorcas, you're doing alright too, so we'll go in a little bit with you here. Marcus, we got our mounted healer. How's your health, boys? It's fine. Why don't you go back and meet the squad? Can I talk to you? I can. Lady Priscilla, I'm glad to see you well. Eric, have you joined Lord Elwood's company as well? Yes. Traveling with them seems to be the safest way for us to continue your search for your family. Eric. Oh, my apologies. This isn't the place to discuss such things. I'm sorry, but Lady Priscilla, my teacher entrusted you to my care. Until you have reached your goal, I will not leave your side. Thank you, Eric. Interesting, okay. Kind of put you out of the grass, unfortunately. <laughs> I don't think you guys will be able to even make it. Yeah, it's fine. We'll retreat to safety soon, dude. Alright. Right here. And I guess just wait. Yeah, that's fine. Let's see. Oh, beautiful. Nice. No damage. Just like before. And look, Loman's about to level up and everything. Alright, guy. Oh, whoa. Look at this. Look at this nice little... Things at the bottom here. Whoa! Sick, dude. I really gotta get you a new sword, though. Like, now. Got more appearing, dudes. Oh, watch out, Lowen! Ah, one damage, one experience, too. Alright, let's deal with these, uh, these raiders here. Like so. Hopefully he doesn't hit. Ah, oh, he got me. He got me. It's fine. There you go, buddy. Level 6. Lowen's becoming quite the warrior, dudes. Nice. Oh, just enough, too. Cool. Level 6 as well. Oh, ooh. Worst level up of the day. Iron Fort. Hmm, so we got another pirate over here, I see. Oh, shit. Do you think he's going over there? Oh, that'd be awful. Let's go ahead and back up with Elwood right here. Yeah, he's trying to make it to the ten. The little ruffian. Oops. Move you up. Move you right here. You. I want you to go over here. Put you somewhere safe. Oops. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, I knew it. Dude, we gotta stop him, dudes. I just feel bad. <laughs> okay. Oh, a go. Take him out. Oh, what about this? 16 damage. Opposed to 14. Alright, you let's try this new cool sword that nice dude gave us. The iron blade, dudes. How cool. Hey, well, he leveled up and everything. Cool. Wow, look at that. He he can even if he go bum rushes the tent, he won't be able to make it. Tra oops. Trade with you. Oh trade. The sword's in the thing. Oh whoops. Alright, it's fine. Uh we have fire spells now we can give to Urk. 
Alright, go right here, I think it was. I forgot. There you go. I don't think they're advancing, dude. Alright, try it. Let's deal with them. I want to kill all these bitches. Experience. Aw, oh, you missed. Un for it, dude. Wouldn't have been perfect. I don't want Rebecca to take a pop shot. Alright. Let's see. You missed. A gnarly war, dude. Sweet. Okay, who's next? I've just defeated every pirate in the sea. Ah, uh, he's gonna have advantage now in everything. Look at that. Huh. Alright, Elway. Wait, do we have to, like, check this? Oops. Double oops. Merch? What do you want? Uh, what do you want to do? And take the iron sword. Oh, look how cool this is, dude. Alright, stuck zero of a hundred. Cool. Um, alright, well, we'll just go up here. It's about time to move in on these bitches. I'm just trying to be safe. Hey, it, it's working out for me, so. That's fine. Can you kill this man? Please? One more. There you go. There you go, Lowen. Give him the business. Alright, we'll wait one more turn. Ah, now this guy's in perfect position. Dane. 67 chance. Right. Alright, so what we'll do... There's a little mini battle to the north right here we're kind of working with. Let's go ahead and retreat a, a little bit. And just guard Rebecca and we should be fine. Alright? Three more dudes left. Oh, he said no. <laughs> Fuck! I thought he would follow us. Okay. What if, what if I'm over here? Will you follow me now? Yes, you will. What a dummy dum dum. No, <laughs> you meant. I think that's Rebecca range, too. These sword fighters don't have the best defenses. Okay. I believe, yep. Perfect. Alright. The sword guy's dead. <laughs> Finally. Oh, look. Rebecca got weapon level increase. Cool. Alright. Mm. Well, I think it's about fucking time, mate. Go in. Wait right here. Okay. Let's go, bitch. You've always been an eyesore to me. No matter how hard I've tried, you two garnered all the attention, all the praise. In the classroom, on the training grounds, everywhere and everything. Eric, you always did care more about appearances than ability. If you had even a hint of skill, perhaps you'd hold your time. I will hear no more, no more. Oh, hold up. That did some damage. Jeez. Oh, that did more. <laughs> nice. Oh, watch out, dude. Watch out, Hector. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, my. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Weapon triangle be damned. Oh, no. <laughs> well, this complicates things now, doesn't it? <laughs> Shit! Um... I'm just gonna go... I, I need this. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna... Just gonna go right here. Kinda need another axe now. Shit. You wanna try to kill him? No, don't take him. Oh, you don't have the... Yeah, right. Urk? Nah. It's too dangerous. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Just fucking... Just do something. Yeah, you know... Alright, that's fine. Lost is the truth. Throne Alicia. Taste my lance. What a time for that to break. My god, you did all that damage to Marcus. Look at that. Eh, unhand me. I'm no one's prisoner. Eh. I'm sorry, buddy. 
Them's the breaks. Hey, Marcus got a level up finally. Look at you. Sweet. Oh, we got a silver lamp. Nice. Come on, Eric. Get up. You, you peasant. You can't treat a proper noble like this. It's too late for niceties. Be thankful you're still so breathing. Eric, you must tell me, where is your father? We've searched the entire castle and there's no one here. Don't be ridiculous. My father would not abandon... No, he never. Ephidel. Ephidel, who is that? Speak, Kerr. Do you want to die here? <laughs> Hector. Eric? Please, you must tell us everything you know. I just want to know where my father is. Ephidel. He appeared at the castle one year ago. He came, and my father changed. Ostia's position had always bothered my father. He felt Laos deserved to rule all of Lycia, but he'd never gone so far as to speak of rebellion. Did you say rebellion? Ephidel had something. With it, he convinced my father to set this plan in motion. My father then sent envoys to several other Marquesses. Marques Farah? He had approved of the idea. What? Never. My father would never agree to such a thing. Believe or disbelieve, that is your choice. First was Marques Santa Rus, then Marques Farah's reply arrived. Marcus Ferrer visited here six months ago to seal his approval. That's not possible. My father and yours argued vehemently that day. Marcus Ferrer always distrusted Ephidel. He tried to convince my father to send Ephidel and the Black Fane assassins out of Lycia. My father would not be persuaded, and Marcus Ferrer left the castle. As you know, he then disappeared. I doubt he's still alive. No. Shut your mouth. I would said he wanted to hear everything. My father? He is but Ephidel's puppet. Listen to anything that villain says. Even watch his own son die. Those are your sort of pe those are the sort of people you're dealing with. Marquis Farah betrayed them. They would not let him live. <laughs> uh, wait, Elwood. Elwood, my father is alive, and I cannot believe he supports rebellion. There must be, there must be a reason. I know. I don't believe any of this for an instant. My brother trusted Marques Farah more than anyone. First, we'll find your father and discover the truth. We'll talk to my brother after that. Hector, I'm sorry. Don't look like that. Your father is surely alive. Right? Yeah, of course. Marcus Laos. Black Fane Assassins. Now this mysterious Ephidel. I'll find them all and prove my father's innocence. Damn, this is really getting fucking good, dude. <laughs> I'm like super into this now. Dane. Alright, well that's it. That was chapter 14. What a fucking battle, dude. That took us a while. Holy shit. That went really good, though. We got a, all kinds of... <laughs> the axe break at the final hit. <laughs> that was ridiculous. Alright, it's fine, though. <laughs> I need to buy a new one now. All right, you guys, hope you enjoyed. I certainly did. That was that was a good time. All right, I'll see you guys later, all right? Peace.